Hello there. So I am playing Mega Mansion Tycoon. I think I've done a video on this one before because I had started it and I haven't come back to it. Anywho's, I have completed. There have updates to this game that I want to share. So they have added the beach house. They have added the penthouse. Now they have the tropical house, which I'm about halfway through. Now you can get through the mega mansion pretty quickly. Beach house doesn't take that long. Penthouse takes a little bit longer. The tropical house actually takes a while to complete. I'd say it's probably about at least a billion <laughs> before you're done with it. So basically it's one of those tycoon games that it's so easy, super easy to play. And it's really, the graphics of the houses are really nice. The stars and the sky at night don't care so much for the kind of very generic trees and scenery. I think they could do a lot of improvement on that. Put some nice, real looking trees in there. The water is kind of buggy because it doesn't really act like water. It doesn't really have a sound of water. But it has boats, jet skis, helicopters, which I really love. So this is the, let me see where I'm at. This is the tropical house. So basically you just go to the mailbox and you don't, you don't have to hang out. I see people just hanging out at the mailbox. And I'm like, well, once you get your mega mansion, your first mansion done, like you can get a car and drive around because no matter what you're doing in the game, you're earning money. So, probably the best thing to do when you first start is to get your income up a little bit. I'm currently, my income is about 8000 and something. So, see, it starts 8852 but I'm in the last house there is to build. So, um, I have a helicopter. So, rather than just standing here, I want to have 25, let's see, what I do is I've calculated how much... 25 million will complete about three and a half percent. So you really need a, about a billion to complete this last house. The first couple houses are you can complete a lot quicker. So rather than just standing here at the mailbox or going AFK, you can just put your avatar at the mailbox or whatever and just go AFK. But there's other things to do other than building in the game. So I've seen videos and pretty much everybody, all they do is just show the house and show the building. But there's actually, you know, you can hang out in the game. You can drive around and go places. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go to my mansion that is complete. Okay, and also you can save up your money to decorate. You can change the colors of furniture and rugs and just kind of give it your own um, look, if you will. Because pretty much the houses are identical, but again, you can color them with the paint tool, although the paint's kind of expensive. So here's my helicopter. Just so you know, if you take your helicopter to across the ocean or whatever to your tropical house and then you spawn a car your helicopter will disappear so you will have to go back to your mega mansion and respawn it you have to go back up to the helicopter pad that's at the top level of your house but you can pretty much park it anywhere you want just as long as you don't spawn a car on another location like i can spawn a car here and it'll still be here so just so you know about that but i love the helicopter so i'm just gonna go play and no matter what you're doing in the game, your income is building up. So I'm 8,800 something a second. So if I spend 10 minutes in game playing, I'm going to earn a few million. And this is actually really easy to operate. You just take your mouse, I use a desktop, and click these arrow up and down buttons with your mouse. I also use my arrows to turn left and right, pan left and right on the keyboard. And WASD, and for some reason E is also functioning with this helicopter, which is kind of unusual for keyboard controls with the game, but it does. It works. Okay, and you, I, I you can go and and I try to not be rude, but I've go to neighbor's house. I had one 
one fellow, he was like, he'd get in my helicopter, and then I'd, I'd fly him over his house, and then he'd parachute down. It's so cool. You can just jump out of the helicopter, and then a parachute will show up on you, and you can parachute down. It's so cool. So I'd just fly over his house. He'd jump in, and then he'd parachute down, and we were just having fun doing that. And I did parachute down a couple times, but one time that I parachuted my, <laughs> my helicopter wreck, so I decided not to jump out of my helicopter anymore. But if your helicopter wrecks, all you have to do is just get in front of it, like if it's on its side, and when it shows the fly, just click the E, and it will upright itself. So, But one of my friends, he, he was flying, and he parked too close to the beach, and apparently there was like an incline, and his, his helicopter went into the water. I was like, oh no. But he did manage to get it back out of the water eventually. So, And you can paint your helicopter as well. And painting your vehicle is free, but painting your furniture inside your house is not free. And it seems like um, when you paint, so like when you when you're first starting, you paint something. It's cheaper to paint when your when your income level is like low. Your parts are cheaper. So before I would recommend if you want to paint your your mansion. Paint it before your income level goes up. Paint it before you go to the next house because it will be like a million dollars. Everything that you paint is like everything goes up price wise to include painting. So, yeah, so once you get up, the higher, the more houses you have completed, the higher everything costs. So, I recommend again, paint your first mansion before everything gets expensive. <laughs> Anyways. Um, like I painted, see those bean bags there? I painted them. I'm gonna like paint these, these. Of course, I like pink everything, but I'll change the colors. So here you can, you can't see anything. That's the only thing about this game, is you have to get closer to the elements that you're going after before they start becoming. And if you don't know the map and know where everything is, just kind of keep and just kind of remember, memorize. I guess I'm trying to say which direction you came from otherwise you'll have to respawn your helicopter um so this is the tropical they've added tropical mansion now so there's a total of four buildings which is pretty cool and also i'm gonna if you don't want to know about something in this game then turn mute me now because i'm fixing to tell you a secret because you'll get a badge for it so right here where this little island is if you land on this helicopter pad and then you go inside that little hut, there's like a secret little thing in there and you get a badge for discovering it. Um, a friend of mine that I met in this game showed me that. Took me here. It's, I just love this helicopter. It is so cool. Love helicopters. I was actually in the military and I was attached to a aviation battalion and i love flying helicopters so i love that sound it's so satisfying <laughs> probably some people may not like it at all but i love it so anyways over here is you'll see the houses the tropical houses so you have beach house and tropical house and they're two different locations so over here are the beach houses and they each have a boat and a jet ski that you can drive around or ride around on which is really cool and you can take your helicopter and yes you can land on the beach but just remember <laughs> I uh, I think I went out on the jet ski and when I went back my helicopter was gone so if you ride drive anything else once you land yeah you'll have to just teleport back to your mega mansion and then respawn your helicopter so I'm gonna go ahead and land this down here this is my whoop, beach house be careful see that you can't really see it until you get up close but see that incline don't land your thing too close because he landed too close to that and it was partly on that and it slid into the water and his helicopter sunk i was like trying not to laugh but i was like oh no no oh, actually i think i have that on video i'll have to share that so let me go ahead and land this baby i'm going to show you my boat this i love this game the graphics in the houses is so cool i think i'm actually landed it's kind of hard to tell though but when you see that bounce that means that you are on the ground all i have to do is get out is either hit the space bar you'll see like that little parachute 
and then ta-da! So see where my this is right here. If I go on the boat, I just want to make sure this is my house because I don't want to go in somebody else's house. Usually people are really cool. They don't like get mad at you, but sometimes you never know. People are like, you know, get out of my house. You know, you just never know. So I always try to be polite because they're all identical. So I don't know which is which. But usually above the house, you'll see like your you're zoomed out, which I wasn't zoomed out at the time. You'll see your face or another person's face above the house, and that tells you whose it is. But I wasn't paying attention, so since I've already landed, all you have to do is to... Okay, so this must be her house. Oh, this is not my house. My bat. My bat. I'm so sorry. <laughs> She's like, why are you on my mailbox? I'll just apologize and tell her that. Sorry. Wrong house. Because they do look identical. Sorry, that's my dogs. <laughs> like why are you but um anyways so i don't know so there's only two here so the other one must be mine and there may be yeah so the since there's only two people in the house in the game i mean oh well actually since i parked my helicopter there i'm gonna go ahead and remove that and um before it disappears <laughs> i'm gonna get back in that and fly to the correct see where my see okay see this right here you see my face above it that's across the way so that shows you where my house is across the way so that's kind of what you want to look for when you're looking for somebody what if you're in the game with a friend and that can kind of help you to find know to know where to land as well as when you're driving because again they are all identical okay so i'm trying to let me get zoomed out. So basically to get in the helicopter to drive it, you get in front of it and there, kind of on this side, click E. Okay. And so see, you can't see the house until you get a little closer. And you can actually, I was, I was like having fun with people. I'd like get right up next to them. They, they show up on my front of my house or in my driveway with our car so I'd break out my helicopter and I'd challenge them to a race you know I'm like come on vroom vroom let's race there is actually a racetrack in this game my friend showed it to me I'm like oh my goodness because anybody knows me knows I love race games like the new Lamborghini game I got a silver uh silver whatever um if you made a bronze silver or gold you get a free UGC anyways so here we go. So this should be mine. So I'm going to go ahead and park it. And yes, you can. There's actually a parking spot there. So I'm going to back it up just a little bit because I kind of want it even. All right. And then just hit the space bar and jump out. And this should be my house. <laughs> yes. And so I just got paid. Now I'm at 53 million. So this is my beach house. Yeah. Let me see uh so this the tropical house is actually really large and it's the one that takes the longest to build just because by the they unlock you can't just like go randomly pick which house you want to build you have to build them in order so first you'll do this one and then when you get about 95 percent done i think then it'll unlock the beach house and you can go start that one without finishing this one but again as you complete the next one, your income goes up and the prices of each part starts going up. And so if you're wanting to go back and decorate and paint, then by the time you get, by the time I got to Tropical House, now to paint each item, it's like a million dollars per item. So, and that's okay because, I mean, you know, you make cash in here so quickly. So it's not, in, it's not really an issue. So now I'm, I'm already up to like 8,000 a second, but anyway so instead of just standing there doing nothing go have some fun get yourself a car they have cars that are really really expensive but some of them are like like this one's only a hundred thousand you know and um they have some that are sold out which uh, some of them you have to get through like a game pass um i like this one right here i'm thinking about getting this one but i'll have to do that later and save up for it because it's 80 million they have some that's like really out there on prices like um this one's 15 million the tires are pretty cool um i think the most expensive one is like 200 and some million but i don't know they do they do sell out they do sell out um let's see there was this one that i really liked but it's sold out 
and then again some you have to have the game I don't have game passes in this game um let's see where's the one that I oh this one I just that almost looks like a Batman mobile that is so cool looking so sleek but it's 35 million and it's sold out so they don't give me any indication on how many are available that I can see so if you see something I wouldn't put it off if you really really want it like as soon as I get this one done the first thing I'll do is saved by this one here because that is just really cool looking and you can paint your cars you, the re, the way that you paint your cars is you get inside the car sit in the driver's seat and then the little color wheel will show up and then you can paint it and they have metallic gloss matte different things you can choose from so I think that's really cool I think that the, the game developer of this game did really good on the graphics um the art in the houses I really have appreciation for art and so I, just really good selections if anybody knows me I love acrylic pour painting type of art and a lot of modern art and a good variety as well so I really appreciate that also the only thing is the scenery could you know put some more realistic trees would be really nice um but anyways I, it is a progressive game so I do believe that the developer is continuing to add like you know just recent additions to the game and who's but it's not just something that you build and go on about your business I mean this is a hangout game it does have voice chat and in camera so I mean you can just come in here with your friends and hang out and so here is the beach and again the water like you can't like it's I don't know the water needs some improvement because like when I jumped off by accident the dock it's like you don't swim like your avatar it's not functional really see what I'm saying like you don't swim in it it, it doesn't <laughs> so anyways that's a little could be improvement on that I like my avatar to swim in games where there's water just for a more more realistic experience and here if you want to spawn your jet ski you just do like that and um, it's okay like if you accidentally jump in the water because I didn't I didn't know this until I kind of figured it out so I landed in the water instead of <laughs> so now I'm walking on the ground which is not normal you don't walk on the ground when you're underwater <laughs> so all you have to do is zoom out get close to it and the E will sit up and that will pull you up out of the water okay so but me or when I first played this I had to like walk around back to the dock or whatever so it's just oh I'd say maybe a little bit buggy when it comes to the water but it's still pretty cool all right so now I'm in drive position and you don't hear anything it's got like that quiet motor but it is started so you just turn use your W W A S D keys and it's okay if you don't park it just right or it'll it'll eventually collect itself now because I did this my helicopter's gonna be gone <laughs> see my helicopter's gone see what I'm saying but that's okay because all I have to do is just go back to my mega mansion and then I'll have to go back to the helicopter pad but look at that boat though that boat is pretty cool I love that boat in fact I'm gonna hop on into the boat and get off of this just hit the space bar get off of that jump in the water get close to your boat. <laughs> look I just land like there's no such thing as gravity oh my goodness so funny anyways it's all good <clears throat> to get close to the boat I'm on the wrong side ah uh, so I gotta get on this side where am I ah I'm walking <laughs> I'm walking on the bottom see how I'm underneath it's not it shouldn't be doing that like I should be floating or something this water is is like glitchy well I can't seem to get to where I need to be and see there's like this ledge here and you can't you can't jump <clears throat> let's see if I can well that's not working I was trying to get well okay so what it worked with the the jet ski did not work with the boat so that's okay so all you have to do in that situation is just click to go to beach house or you can click here 
and then wait five seconds otherwise it'll give you a warning to wait and then click back to the beach house you have to wait one second yeah and listen to that oh there's my my helicopter oh okay cool 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 so they're very good all right i think it was a car that i spawned that caused it to disappear okay so back here and i cashed in so i'm now at 61 million I was trying to get up to 100 million before I started working because I don't really like have to do a little bit and then have to go all the way back to the mailbox to start all over because literally you'll only complete about 4% at the most with about 25 million. 3.5% <laughs> to 4% gets completed. Okay, so there's my boat. <clears throat> I love, and I don't see any controls for like night mode. That would be one nice thing that they could add if you could control the day and night mode. Some games allow that, some don't, especially if you're going out in the boat. I love the stars. <clears throat> Sorry, allergies. Okay, so I'm going to get up in here. <clears throat> Drive mode. Here we go. It's a little awkward because, you know, you're kind of in a tight spot to start with, but it maneuvers pretty, pretty easily. I'm going to run into the thing there. Oh, look, did you see that? There was a dolphin. Oh, my gosh. Oh, how cool. What? There's dolphins. Oh, see, I have not seen that before. Be very gentle and go up on them. Am I going to get a badge or something for... I'm hanging out with dolphins? Well, um, okay, that's different. Huh. And then you turn this way and you don't see them. Did they disappear? Okay. Well, that's cool. I have not seen that before in this game. Maybe other people have. I have not. So, again, I've seen a lot of people doing videos on the building part. But I don't really see, like, people just hanging out. And, you know, this is not just build a mansion and it's all about the mansion. I mean, once you get your stuff built, I mean enjoy it you know there's a lot of cool things to do in this game and there are places you can go to eat like there's um some kind of burger place where you can get meals in fact if you see on my screen in the middle of my screen i have a meal that i picked up from some restaurant so i'm going to go back to <laughs> uh, i'm going to go back to here just to get out of the water because i'm just I don't feel like <laughs> walking up that thing. So this is the beach house. And now I'm going... Wait, that's the tropical house. Back to the beach house. Alright. So now it's getting dark. So I'm going to take this... Uh, Actually, I'm just going to leave this here. Because I want to go to my tropical house. And work on it a little bit to show you. Okay. All right, so this is, I am now currently, at a, I'm at about 61. Now I'm going to cash in. So now I have 64 million. So all I have, that's all I have to do is just touch, touch the mailbox. So what these arrows are, basically there was viable play buttons, which I think that was something that was going on during the hunt. That was one of the things that helps you achieve that goal. Anywho, but they kind of help guide you to where, if like at some point, when I mean, you're not sure, like when you stop and you go back, you're not sure, like, where's all the buttons? Where do I, where did I leave off? You know, because these buildings are really big. <laughs> you know, there's multiple levels and it's easy to kind of get lost. But just take an appreciation at the graphics in here. Now, I changed the color of this little chair over here. Um, I changed it to blue. And um, I do wish that I had painted everything in my mansion before I got this far in the game. Because now it's about a million dollars. <laughs> and then the last house it was like 700000 So like for example let me show you. Let's say I want to change these right here. Let's change, I'm going to change the color of this rug. Right. So let's say I want to make it like this color here. Whoop. I'm not sure what I'm changing there. Okay. Let me stand on the rug. I've got this right here. So I kind of like that color, but see the price is 1.5 million, which I'm going to go ahead 
you know, because I like that color. It's like the color of water. I love that color. I painted one of my rooms and one of my houses that color in real life. And uh, anyways, okay, so that's enough of that. But see what I'm saying? Just imagine if you paint a lot of things, how much money you're going to go through. And um, so anywho, yeah, so if you know for sure that you're going to do, change colors and things in your mega mansion, definitely do that before you go on, on to the next house. Anywho, so now I have to find my way back. See where these arrows are guiding me? You can kind of show that they're going up. So what I need to do is I need to go to the upper level. This house does not have an elevator. Okay. The penthouse is like an apartment building. And you go upstairs and you go inside. Once you get off the elevator, you go through double doors. And then the inside, it has its own elevator, which is separate than the elevator of the building. And then I think the other house has an elevator. But anyways... <laughs> So I'm saying I can't even find it. Oh, so the stairs are over here. <clears throat> this is a tropical, yeah, tropical house. Yeah. So there's so big. I love the waterfalls. Oh, and by the way, by the way, before I go upstairs, I want to show you something. This is so cool. I, of course, you know me. I love musical instruments, especially in my Sims. All my Sims are musical. They all play the piano. They play multiple instruments. How nice is that? Classic. So all you want, if you want to hear the music play, just, yeah, you just touch that. I just think that is so nice. And I saw a guitar also, and I don't know if that's interactive, like if you could interact. It was just, it was like just as a display on the wall. So I don't know if it's something that you can, that would be cool if you could interact with it. <laughs> Anyways, <clears throat> but I love the decor in this building okay so it's sometimes it's a little hard to find the buttons but here we go here's some buttons up in here so this is kind of where I need to get to going and that's all you do you just you know everything style wise all pretty much selected for you look at that it's got a half a happy face some cute art it'd be really cool if you could like change some things out Whoop. And there, this happens. Sometimes this happens. There's a little bit of bugginess with this game. Like sometimes when you step on things, you get trapped inside walls. This has happened a few times. When it happens, you'll just basically have to start all over. <laughs> oh my goodness. So you see, I've only got up 1%. Ah. Or you'll have to reset, which when you, if you reset, it's going to take you all the way back. And I think that will unpark my, I'll just click go to Mega Mansion. Because <laughs> I don't want to like reset where my helicopter is. And then go back to my tropical house. I have to wait one second. Yeah, you have to wait a few seconds before you teleport, teleport, whatever it is. So that's the only thing, and I, I don't know, like, which one of the buttons, which one of the rooms are, are buggy like that when they just trap you. So that's only happened, like, me. This is, like, maybe the third time. So it's not too bad, but it's not a big deal. It's just that you have to go all the way back <laughs> and find the stairs again, go all the way back upstairs. But look at these. Look at that pretty. And you can turn the, the lights on and off. Some of them operate by sensors. I painted that. See that pretty pink? Of course I didn't. Now those other chairs that are lavender, they came like that. But I love the that I can make a room pink if I want to, of course. <clears throat> I'd like to be able to like paint the building itself. Okay, so now the arrows are at like level with my body, but it's way over there. So I know that the button that I'm looking for is on this level. And so I'm, I've am i still got 57 million. And again, it takes about a billion to complete this. So if you want to just like, if you don't feel like, you know, doing gameplay, you can just 
have your avatar sit there, kind of go AFK or whatever, do chores or whatever you got to do, wait for your income to build up. But um, obviously this is designed for, you know, game time because developers get paid for the amount of time premium members spend in the game. Okay, so this room's got a, seems like different colors in it, but it's got a lot of blue. Oh, wait, we're not done. 